Apple just released iOS 18.4 beta 2 and there are some exciting new features and changes and fixes you need to know about from new control center toggles to brand new emojis Apple is refining the iOS experience in big ways so in this video I'll walk you through everything that's new in beta 2 and let you know what to expect next all right so first and foremost let's talk about the size of the update on my iPhone 16 Pro Max the update came in at 1.34 gigs so expect it to be over 1 gig for the most devices but if you check out the build number it's now 22E5216H the H at the end indicates that we still have few more betas to go before the final release a big update in beta 2 is the new visual intelligence toggle in control center previously iPhone 16 Pro and the Pro Max users needed the camera control button to activate visual intelligence but now it has its own dedicated toggle which means iPhone 15 Pro and 15 Pro Max users now get visual intelligence support simply add the toggle in control center or even assign it to the actual button for quick access if you have been using ambient music and control center you might notice a small visual tweak the productivity icon has been slightly repositioned moving the check mark to the left instead of the behind the square also the Siri section and control center has been renamed to Apple intelligence and Siri a new Apple intelligence icon replaces old glimpse these are small refinements but signal Apple shift for deeper AI integration all right next up who doesn't love new emojis beta 2 introduces seven new New brand new emojis including tired smiley face fingerprint paint splatter root vegetable leafless tree harp and shower these new emojis will also work with genmoji meaning you can create custom emoji variation based on these designs let me know in the comments down below which emoji is your favorite all right next up a small but useful change when downloading an app in the app store the stop button has been replaced with a pause button finally now if you pause a download a resume button appears making it clearer that your app isn't just stuck it's just paused which is a really clever and much needed update if you use the new mail categories you'll see new explainer pop up when up when opening the app after updating it explains how categories work and lets you disable primary inbox with one tab if you turn it off and later want it back just go to mail settings and re-enable categories and easy as that next priority notification in iOS 18.4 just got a huge improvement beta 2 now lets you manually exclude apps from being prioritized I think this is a really nice feature previously iOS automatically determined with the AI which notifications were important but now you can disable priority notification for specific apps so if you don't want to get bothered by that app this is really useful like screen time or Apple TV if you don't want them just turn them off and just remove them from high priority managing your deleted photos is now easier in beta 2 the recently deleted album in photos now has two new options at the bottom recover all to instantly restore all deleted photos or delete all permanently to remove everything at once previously you had to manually select multiple photos before deleting them this streamlines the photo management and saves a lot of time so how does beta 2 perform from my testing so far performance feels solid no major slowdowns or crushes so far in terms of battery life it seemed stable compared to the beta one so nothing uh, too dramatic there but when it comes to bug fixes specifically for apple news and apple music it still crushes a lot so if you had battery drain issues in beta one let me know in the comments down below if beta two improved it for you so what's next beta three could arrive as soon as next week march 10 in between march 10 and 14 or apple might wait another week we will likely see weekly beta releases from now on leading up to a final ios 18.4 public release in early April but that pretty much wraps it up everything that is new in iOS 18.4 beta 2 from new visual intelligence toggles to seven brand new emojis Apple is making steady improvement with each update let me know in the comments down below which one is your most favorite new feature and also if you enjoyed this video please leave me a big thumbs up and also subscribe down below because it really helps the channel out thanks again for watching I will catch you guys next video peace out